Hello everyone, welcome to Route to Mathematics. In this video, we are going to solve this interesting question. So the given question is solve 9 to so the given question is solve 9 to the power x plus 6 to the power x equals to 4 to the power x. Okay. So before going through the solution, please do subscribe my channel and hit the like button for more such interesting videos. So without any delay, let's start the solution. So the given equation is 9 to the power x plus 6 to the power x equals to 4 to the power x. So in the first step, let's just factorize all the bases. So we can write 9 as 3 to the power 2 whole to the power x and 6 as 2 multiplied with 3 to the power x equals to 4 as 2 to the power 2 whole to the power x. This implies this. You can write 3 to the power 2x plus 2 to the power x multiplied with 3 to the power x equals to 2 to the power 2x. Okay. Now taking all the term to the left hand side, we have 3 to the power 2x plus 2 to the power x multiplied with 3 to the power x minus 2 to the power 2x equals to 0. Okay. In the next step, let's just take u equals to 2 to the power x and v equals to 3 to the power x. Now substituting u and v, the above equation becomes v square plus uv minus u square equals to 0. So let's just consider this equation as a quadratic equation in v. Okay. So our quadratic equation is always in form of ax square plus bx plus c equals to 0. So in the above equation, let's take x equals to v a equals to 1, b equals to u and c equals to minus u square. Now applying the quadratic formula, we can write v equals to minus u plus or minus root under u square minus 4 multiplied with 1 multiplied with minus u square divide by 2 multiplied with 1. This implies v equals to minus u plus or minus root under u square plus 4 u square divide by 2 this implies v equals to minus u plus or minus root 5 u divide by 2 so we have taken u equals to 2 to the power x and v equals to 3 to the power x which implies u and v must be greater than 0 so we can ignore the negative value so we have v equals to root 5 minus 1 divided by 2 multiplied with u. This implies v by u equals to root 5 minus 1 divided by 2. Now let's just put the value of u, v and u here. So we have v equals to 3 to the power x and u equals to 2 to the power x which is equals to root 5 minus 1 divided by 2. So... We can write 3 by 2 whole to the power x equals to root 5 minus 1 divided by 2. Now taking log both the sides. So we can write ln 3 by 2 whole to the power x equals to ln root 5 minus 1 divided by 2. This implies this. So applying the logarithm rule we can write x ln 3 by 2 equals to ln root 5 minus 1 divided by 2. This implies x equals to ln root 5 minus 1 divided by 2 divided by ln 3 by 2. So by applying logarithm division rule we can write ln root 5 minus 1 minus ln 2 divided by ln 3 minus ln2 is our answer. I hope you have understood the solution. Thanks for watching. Please do subscribe my channel and hit the like button for more such interesting videos. Thank you.